When we look at the staging of melanoma, we're interested in three things. TNM for tumor node metastasis. And depending on the combination of these, you can end up in different stage. Why is that important when your doctor tells you you're stage one, stage two, stage three, stage four? That's important because the survival can become different depending on which stage you're at. The decision-making becomes different depending on where you're at. And the potential trials that may be open to you will become different. The early stages are the ones that the tumor is microscopic. Once you get past the membrane that connects the skin to the underlying structure, at that level, the tumor now has a potential of spreading because now it can start to go in and start infiltrating the underlying structures and potentially blood vessels and nodes and so forth. So that's when we become interested in the nodes. The nodes, we either look at them as there's no nodal involvement, which is good, that means it's an earlier stage, or they could be micrometastasis, where the node itself doesn't look enlarged, but there's tiny infiltration of cells into that node. And then last but not least, we're interested in the metastasis. Is metastasis regional, or has it in fact gone to distant locations? For example, if you have a metastasis in your brain, that unfortunately is the behavior of a rapidly dividing, aggressive cancer. And so the management becomes different. And then once you pull all of these information together, now you have the T staging, which is for the tumor, whether it's less than a millimeter or one to two millimeters or greater than four millimeters, each of these will put you in a different stage. And then the N for nodes, whether it's no nodes, two to three nodes, nodes in transit, or multiple nodes that are distant, that could put you in a different category. And M for metastasis, which is whether you have no metastasis, thankfully, early stage, a regional metastasis versus distant metastasis, and the number of areas where it's metastasized. The good news for people that have later stage melanomas is that they have more potential for disease-free survival and more potential with some of these newer treatments that are out there to fight the tumors for them.